Hey everyone, welcome to Path to Nowhere. So before we proceed to uh, Mrs. Skill Review, we're going to be going through all of these updates. So th these will fall on December 20. So interrogation for Mess, interrogation for Serpent as well. Then we have here uh, the banner, which includes uh, Mess and Serpent, plus Victoria and Ruleka. So this is, uh, they are, they have actually a chance, an increased chance of arrest for all four. Then moving to uh, Mess herself. Let's go over if she can really compete with what we have um, as your sinners. So first and foremost, she is rank A, which is good. Um... Not really hard to get copies of. Um, decent. Especially for this event, I'm sure um, she's going to be uh, free. Then we have here um, her, her what they call this, her type, which is Fury. Fury, um, she might be competing with a couple of uh, high-level Furies already. You have their um, Zoya. You have their Nox. If you don't have those two... Probably she can carve out a frontline position for you guys. But if you have those two, I don't think she can really match up with those guys. So, um, but we have to go over her kip. So, for her normal attack. So, Mess uses uh, Vicious Smith. Vicious Smith, by the way, is um, her ultimate. So, she uses her ultimate to switch between the hammer and the sword. So, if she uses the hammer... So it's uh, regular damage. If you, she uses the sword, it's higher percentage of your attack. So uh, much higher damage. Um, but it's going to be uh, lower attack speed. So those those are the trade-offs. So depending on who she's going to be facing, you're going to be deciding on it's either going to be a hammer or a sword. So for her ultimate, so she gains an attack bonus. And... Um, and miss attack increasing after attacking with Smith. Uh, Smith's hammer increases. Okay, that's the, that's what is also said in her basic attack. So there are differences in terms of attack speed. The attack change caused by this effect is limited within a certain range. So very simple kit. Going on to her passive, we have compatibility weapons. After switching weapon to Smith's hammer, Mess gains an attack speed bonus for certain seconds. After switching weapon to Vicious Smith, Mess next few attacks will be lower, will not lower her attack. Okay, so nice addition to her kit. And the last passive is going to be this is going to be weird because when she switches. She grants a random ally sinner um, increased attack within 3x3 three three square around her. But what if the sinner is going to be a non-attacker? So that's going to be a problem. So positioning um, is the key here. Who you're going to be placing with her. You could actually isolate her with two other sinners. Um, it's, it's, it's going to be remedied by the placement, by the way. You don't have to lump even the non-attackers non beside her or behind her. So that is your consideration when triggering her passive. So initial attribute, a sinner adept at physical output damage is increased by a certain percentage and an extra percentage for enemies with broken cores. So she has extra damage. And phase 2 is extra damage for those with broken course so from my end um i think she's gonna be she's, she's gonna be okay she's gonna be average especially for a free uh sinner she's decent she's gonna be okay especially if you guys have been have just started the game but if you guys started a month ago and you have zoya already you have nox already I don't think she's going to be carving out a role in your roster at this point. Not even for the buffs that she gives. But for those who just began recently, who those, those who don't have Nox and Zoya, I think this is a good time that you can use Mess. She's going to be a free unit for the game, a free sinner for the game. So um, this is going to be beneficial for those who just joined uh, Path to Nowhere. So that is it, guys. Those are my thoughts on Mess. Um, it's it it's a shame that she 
wasn't able to be released at first she could have you know been used by some of uh, the players early game especially early or you know early days of um since launch but again it is what it is and we'll have to be contented with uh, her being released now but again she's a nice piece um she's decent she's average but uh again if you have those ssrs uh or sorry though the s those s ranks i don't think you'll be needing her as of the moment probably a collection piece for your roster so Thank you very much, guys, for staying this far. Put your comments down below and let us hear from you on your comments on mess. Thank you. Stay safe. This is the Warden, and I'm out of here.